Hello, hello, hello. How are you doing, Libra? This is Positive Thoughts and Energy. Good morning, good afternoon. Oh my goodness, good evening. Good morning, good afternoon, good night, whenever you come across this reading. I hope everyone is staying safe. I love you guys. To all of my subscribers, new subscribers, please make sure you like it and share my content so it can revolve, evolve around YouTube. To new viewers, cross watchers, come on in. Take what resonates, okay? Leave the rest for someone else. Let's get started. So, uh, Libra, when I was doing your pre-shuffle, you are someone, you are someone is thinking about walking away from a connection. So, that was in your uh, pre-shuffle. Okay, yeah. So, you got the world card. So I'm trying to figure out if spirit guys want me to take this upright or you want, you want me to take it reverse. I feel like it's time for a new beginning. Spirit guys say take it in the upright. I feel like you've been in a dark place with this situation. Okay. And you're ready. This is the world. The world is out with the old and in with the new. I feel like this transition has been very dark, been very hard on you. But I feel like um, you're ready for a new beginning, maybe elsewhere uh, from this relationship. Maybe that's what's going wrong or maybe a job. I don't know. I don't know your life. Okay, Spirit Guys, tell me more about the energy for Libra. The energy for Libra. This is for Libra. What's the energy? Energy for Libra. Okay. Yeah, I feel like you're doing some some manifestation, magic in the mirror. Maybe you looked in the mirror. You're looking in the mirror at yourself and you just, um, you could be manifesting um, something, you know, manifesting a new beginning. You're trying to change maybe your ways or change, you know, you know, be a better person from, yep, you're trying to make a decision. That's the card that fell out. You're trying to make a decision. You're looking in the mirror. You're trying to make a decision maybe on this relationship on if you should walk away or not. Because like I said in the pre-shuffle, you or someone is thinking about walking away from a, from the connection. And so you definitely had a crossroad about starting a new beginning, uh, staying, you know, or leaving. Um, and uh, you've been doing a lot of, you know, looking looking at the situation because you got the magician. You've been doing a lot, but I feel like some of you feel like you're all tied up. I feel like you can't, you, you feel like you can't get out of this. Um, you want to make a decision, but you feel like you just can't get out of it. You know, it's like your hands are tied right now. Maybe you and this person has something together. Maybe you and this person is codependent, something, maybe kids, or maybe, uh, maybe you have a house or some, 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 some things together. Um, and you kind of tied up right now, but it's a dark place, uh, for you. Okay. Um, a lot of rest and re rest and rejuvenation. Some of you need to do a lot of re get some rest because I feel like uh, abdominal or your chest. Okay, you need to rest and uh, rejuvenate because um, some of you may start having problems here, or you had to have maybe some surgery or something, and you need to take it easy. Okay, so spirit got any other energy card? Okay. All right, let's see. See what spirit guys got. Spirit guys, this is for Libra. What's the message for Libra? What is the message? Oh. Hold on, let me get that card, Libra. Okay, the card came out as awakening. A lot of you have awakened and you realize that it's maybe best that this relationship is over. A lot of you are starting a new beginning because you have the world card. You have awakened. You've done a lot of, you've done some mirror work trying to get yourself together because I feel like you've been in a dark place. You've been feeling all alone by yourself. But see, the, 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 the world is turning and it's, and it's about to get bright. Things are about to change. Uh, I feel like you was going through the dark night of the soul. Um, and you had to do a lot of maybe some healing, but um, you are awakening slowly. 
and you realizing that there's a lot out in that world, a lot of oysters. It's enough out there for everybody. You're looking out there like it's a big world out there. And you want to, you know, I feel like, you know, once you don't awaken and you're coming out of this storm that you're in, uh, you're going to have a different insight on life is what I'm saying. Spirit guys, any other message for, okay, thank you. Yeah, you're saying it's time to level up. You say it's time. I feel like it just came in my, it just, just what just came in. It's time to level, it's time for me to get my shit together. I, I, and I don't, I don't cuss. I don't like to cuss much, but when spirit guides give it to me, I have to. Um, it's time to level up. You have awakened. You say, you know what? I'm ready to live my life. I'm ready to keep going. I feel like a lot of you are listening to your intuition. Okay, a lot of you in your darkness, in your healing, in your in your dark times, you really got in tune with your inner tuition, that gut feeling, you know, uh, that you have been ignoring for a while. And you come to the terms that you have awakened. It's like you have had an epiphany and you woke up and said, it's time for me to get my shit together. It's time for me to level up. It's time for me to level up. And and. um um, and I feel like, you know, you're going to listen to your intuition. And um, I feel like you're saying, um, this is my season. It's my time. It's my time to, it's my time to uh, level up and, and get something going in my life. That's what I feel. Even though you can be at rage and upset uh, of how this situation is going or how this situation is playing out, spirit guides want me to tell you, do not do anything that is going to jeopardize you, um, your future, okay? Um, I feel as though that Libra... Um, the, your, your situation, it was not reciprocal. Either you was not reciprocal towards your mate or your mate was not reciprocal towards you in this relationship. And you have a lot of sleepless nights. I feel like you're getting to the point you're saying, I want out of this. Yeah. Either you're saying it or it's reversible. They're saying they want out of this. Someone is up at night and they just want out of it. They're tired of bearing the pain, going through a lot of anxiety, a lot of depression. Someone just want out of it. A lot of swords here. Gemini, Libra, Aquarius. A lot of swords in this reading. Someone just, this could be you, Libra, saying I just want out of it. Or this could be your partner. They really are tired and they want out of this. Okay. Yeah, I feel as though this is either you, Libra, saying you don't want to take a leap of faith with this relationship, or this is them saying they don't. But you're definitely getting impatient about it. You're definitely tired. You're angry. Somebody's angry about the situation, okay? Thank you, Spirit Guys. What other message for Libra? What other message? What other message? Thank you for Libra. So, yeah, you have awakened, double confirmation. It's almost like you came out of a coma. You have come out of coma and you have awakened. You got double confirmation here. 40, 40, break down to 20, 20, 20, break down to 10, 10, 10, 10. It's time for a new beginning. Okay. Uh, you have judgment here. You have awakened. Um, it's time to level up. It's time for you. You know this is... This is either you or your person. You know it's time to level up. Um, and I feel like you just don't want to take a leap of faith anymore. You're tired of the BS or someone's tired of your BS. Either way. Okay. I feel like you're going to, someone's going to express to someone, either you're going to express to this person that, you, you know, someone's going to leave somebody out in the cold. Yeah. Someone's going to walk away from somebody. This is you, Libra, or... This can be your person. Um, but I feel like, Libra, you are stuck. For some reason, you're stuck. Mm -hmm. Look, you, you want to you wanna speak the truth, but you're stuck. You're in, a, you're in a situation. You could be dealing with a Capricorn or a Gemini intuitively, but you're stuck in a toxic situation. Or it could be a codependent. Maybe you're co-parenting and you feel like you're stuck. 
Mm -hmm. You feel like you're stuck in this situation. Some of you feel like you're stuck. Some of you have awakened, had epiphany, and you're moving on. You're bossing up. You're bossing up. You're the emperor. You're moving on. You're trying to get control of your life, and you're trying to... Um, you're trying to get out of this. And some of you, you just can't get out of. You're just stuck right now. You don't know what to do. But I see happiness. I see a message. Um, I feel like you're going to get a message that's going to come in that's going to make you happy. Very soon, it can be from an Aries, another Aries, Leo, or Sagittarius. That's going to put a smile on your face. That's going to change your life. It could be a job. It could be a, another person. But for some of you, you definitely had a decision of leaving this person. Um, some of you, you're going to, some of you, you're stuck in it because you're codependent. Maybe you got an apartment, a house or something together and you can't get out of this toxic situation right now. But, um, spirit guys is saying, um, to, um, some of you ready to live your life. You ready to get out there and live your wife life. You, you want a wife. Okay. Some of you want a wife. It just came into my spirit, but you have awakened and you ready to live. You ready to move on. But some of you, you're stuck and you can't move right now. You're stuck in a situation that you can't move. I'm Boss of Thoughts Energy Libra. Until next time.